Hello, this is uh, Matt from the popular rock outfit Evile. Um, just to give her on the official announcement on the new album. We've just finished recording and mastering. We got it back yesterday and had our first listen to it all the way through from start to finish. It's, uh, it's good stuff. So um, I just want to let everyone know the album's going to be called Five Serpent's Teeth. Um, and the idea behind that, I'm going to keep it quite vague because I want people to think about it themselves. But it, um, it, it's connected to one of the songs on Infected Nations. Um, when I was writing that, that was based on something, and it comes from the same source, the album title. But it, uh, it, it, it takes on it takes on its own meaning for this new album, um, which leads on to I don't want to give away too much about the themes and the concept and all the overall you know, ins and outs of every single detail of the album because I have a problem with most releases nowadays in that. You're given everything all at once. Like you, you know, you're given your titles, you're given the artwork, and you're given all the meanings straight away without having to think about anything. So you know, just so you know what you're buying. And I kind of miss the day when you when you went into things blind, not knowing what you were getting, and you can discover things for yourself. I kind of miss that. So I'm, I want to do that with this. And uh, all I'll say is that uh, dreams feature quite heavily. Um, you know, some of them might be from dreams I've had, so it won't make any sense to anyone. But you know, you might have the same dreams or connect to that. Um, so you will hear the word dreams quite a lot throughout the album. <laughs> um, but yeah, I don't really want to give too much away. There's a, there's, you know, there's a few personal things on there. Um, and the big thing which people are going to pick on straight away is that we've, uh, we've written an actual song. I don't want to call it a, a ballad, but it, it's a ballad. <laughs> um, it's it kind of divided us as a group as well because it's kind of uh, it has different meanings for different people within you know within like me all and Ben uh, Joel as well and um, it's it's about Mike because um, you know we lost our bass player in 2009 those who didn't know um, and so it's it's based on Mike uh, but to me just just me because I'm doing this this is just personally me not Evile um, it's not for Mike. Uh, to me, the fast, crazy, heavy stuff's a mic, because that's what he loved, you yeah? know? But I think he was a, a bit of a secret cheese master at how he liked a bit of his battle stuff, like on the slide. But, um, and I think to all and Ben, you know, it's a song for Mike. So I mean, it might have that same divide for fans. When you listen to it, you might get the same thing. Um, you know, you either think it's for Mike or you think it's inspired by what happened or. But it, th there is there's a meaning to the song. Um, there's just something I want to say, um, which follows on from what I said at Bloodstock last year when we played there. Um, it's just a message I wanted to give out, but we couldn't really put across in a ridiculously fast mental song. So um, why did that? So we, we put it across. We've written a proper song for it um, using riffs that I've been playing around with for years, and it's uh, it's come out pretty good. So let's see what people think. Um, I think the album comes out at the end of August, so uh, keep those eyes open.